wow, this is the first time I've looked at myself today. Um, I gotta get ready because we have friends coming over today. Lucy and Lauren will be here very soon. And we're just so excited because it is officially like, at least we're like getting into the prep and getting things situated for James's birthday on Monday. So it's basically after tonight, it's basically birthday weekend. So we're very excited and it's gonna be a good day. little girl. Yeah. We got Lucy and Lauren and Evie. And Everson. <laughs> he wants these paws. Hi girlfriend. We're working on some birthday party decorations for the little boy while he's snoozing. <laughs> what are you two up to? James you woke up. Let's see you walk. Let's see you walk. Yay! Oh. Take a This is a massive spill down <laughs> I know I mentioned this before, but Lauren has sewn quilts for James, has pillows for James, and she just helped me. Like, oh! Jamesy did a somersault. It's okay. You all right? <laughs> um, Lauren helped me finish up like the last details of his Halloween costume. <laughs> and it looks really, really good. I'm really happy with it. And I was like just gonna wing bits of it. We weren't always supposed to have her come over to help me. It just so happened to line up. So I know Susan Ryan, my mom, would be very proud of our handmade costumes. Lucy's being mini mouse. That was just Jamesy getting pumped at the frozen um, castle. So stinking cute. Our visitors have left. James didn't take as long of a nap as he typically does, so he'll probably go down again soon. Um, we had a lovely visit with our dear, dear friends. I don't pick up the camera as much as I'd like to when they're here, but our time with them always flies by. We love them so much. So not only did we finish up James's Halloween costume, which I'm so relieved about, we also got decorations situated for James's birthday, cake and coffee. They'll be up until his actual birthday though, but um, we're having the immediate family over tomorrow to celebrate. And yes, I just feel like, I, I didn't expect us to do that, but like Lauren is incredible at that sort of stuff. And like we met in art school, she knows she just me and her are so on the same page and she's like let's just do it um she's just the very best friend so yeah i feel good about that and i think peter might have ordered a pizza so i'm very excited about that as well Alrighty, it is much later i don't even know if Peter, I don't even know if we vlogged our pizza. We got a sausage deep dish pizza from Diagostino's. It's on Southport, we've shown it before. It was so good, like very, very good. And we also got waffle fries and like cheesy garlic bread. It was all very good. We'll definitely be going there again, ordering from there again, which is nice because like we've kind of still been like like looking around at different pizza places nearby us. And it's not super, super close, but it's close enough for delivery. Um, so yeah, that was really delicious. Peter actually head to the south side for some personal stuff. I don't believe that he will be vlogging. I am getting stuff together for tomorrow. And I'm about to do the most Sue Ryan, again, that's my mom, um, thing that you can do for getting like ready for a party and I will show you. This will be the only 
sneak peek I'll give you. Um, I mean, the decorations are just kind of like simple, but but still thoughtful. Um, and this is just two banners of a picture of every month from James's first year with the little ribbons. I did take apart our Halloween tablescape because we're gonna have like the cake and the coffee and all that here. Um, getting some like stuff just organized, but this is what I'm about to do. So my mom would like, if she bought two different kinds of napkins, she would sit and organize and put like one polka dot, one of one design and then another, one of the next. So I'm gonna sit and do that and it's kind of one of those tasks that's therapeutic to me. So I'm gonna do that and James is actually napping and it's 7 p.m. So we'll see how that goes. Um, but until then, this is where I'll be. Look who is awake. He's never seen this movie before. It's called Luca. I'm joking. He's seen it a million times, but loves it still. Are you zoning? <laughs> you love it? Mm -hmm. That's you. These are the really cute jammies that Lauren, Lucy, and Mikey got you. Cute, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. This is another really nice present that he got from his friends today. It's like a light up board, like finger painting situation, but with no mess. It just like changes colors. You love it. Du Mara Boschur. Check out this bed head. So it is definitely the next day, um, but I just wanted to sign off really quick. Our day kind of like wound down unexpectedly fast. Um, I think anyone who has experience with grief understands that like big days, birthdays, milestones, they always you know, like they bring up sad emotions as well. And so I kind of was like in total party prepping mode. And like, it like truly hit me that like my mom isn't gonna be here. And of course that my dad isn't going to be here. Um, and so Peter and I kind of just like talked for a long time and just kind of, I don't know, like dealt with those emotions. And so I didn't feel fitting to like, pick up the camera at all. Um, but I also just kind of wanted to like bring that up in conversation because we talk about real life and we, um, we don't want to pretend like those things aren't going on alongside the joy that we experience. We've always brought you guys along on both ends of things. Um, and so what's cool is there were so many moments yesterday during the day where I brought up my mom and she is, still so much here and so much like she's a part of this day so much and it's just like not in the way that we want her to be of course we want her here she deserves to be here um and after waiting so long to have a first birthday for a baby it's just like how how is this real? so yeah that is kind of how, where our night went last night um and now we're fresh this morning. I'm gonna finish up our to-do list um, and celebrate our little one. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>